What's up guys, Mike the Coder here. Today we're gonna talk about should you focus on speed in competitive programming or should you focus on solving the next harder problem, right? So in competitive programming, when we solve problems, right, we submit a solution to a problem and then it basically, we have a countdown timer when it goes down, right? And then when we submit a solution, we get more points based on that. So the idea is that should we focus on speed or should we focus on the next problem? Because if you focus on the next problem, you get more points, but you may not be able to solve it if you don't pass all the cases. Or if you solve the easy ones that you know how to solve, solve them faster so you get more points. Now, in my opinion, I've been doing this for like a year or two, like actually seriously, and I focused way too much on speed. Like I got to this point where the first problem I could actually solve on ad coder, like less than a minute or two, actually both of these problems, I got a minute and a two minutes and I, my rating did not increase that much because at the th third problem or fourth problem, which I couldn't solve the fourth problem, third problem, it took me at, at least 20 minutes to solve. And that actually does affect your rating, right? So it's actually better if, in my opinion, that you focus on the next problem, the harder problem, instead of focusing on speed. Like if you just focus on trying to solve one problem, the first problem faster and faster, essentially is that your, your rating is just gonna like oscillate over and over again. I was able to like the, the, the times when I only solved one problem, this is the time where I had barely little rating increase and I was just focusing on seeing if I could solve the first problem less than a minute over and over again and that didn't really increase my rating at all. It just kept oscillating on ad coder. It was only the time when like here at this point where I was actually start, starting to solve a little harder problems where my writing actually increased. So it's actually not a good idea if you just focus on speed because speed doesn't really help you that much. Like I did, I solved way too many easy problems just focusing on speed. In fact, that's actually one of my worst things that I did for the past two years when I was on code forces. Cause look at this. I my rating literally kept oscillating up and down because I was just kept focusing on speed. Like this part, if you look at this part, when I got like, uh, was a division two look, okay. So division two, this part, the problem a, I solved it in seven minutes. Okay. In seven minutes. And I just kept trying to see if I could solve it like less than seven minutes, maybe six minutes, five minutes. And in my opinion, that does not help you at all. Cause if you keep, keep trying to solve this, for, like I, 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 like if you keep trying to solve decreasing the time, there's no, you're not going to increase your rating that much. Like being able to solve an 800 problem underneath five minutes is not going to help you that much. You're going to end up oscillating between 800 and nine and, and a thousand. So speed does don't, don't focus on speed and competitive programming. You're going to not, your speed is it's just going to like your rating is just going to like converge to one point and it's not going to improve. So yeah. And also some part times in my, in, sometimes when I kept doing a contest, like I was, I would just like give up on a problem and I just submit it to see, submit a random problem. And I just don't look at the problem because it was way too early and don't do that all either because your rating is going to drop if you actually don't solve the problem because you're not really trying. So yeah, these four times I didn't really care at all in the contest and then my rating just dropped. So then like went back up and then it went dropped again and it kept oscillating. So yeah, don't just like, I don't know, don't just submit for the sake of submitting in a problem. But yeah, that's just what I have to say. Um, only focus, don't focus so much on speed. Only, try to solve the next problem that you couldn't solve. So if you're at like, if you could solve the first problem already underneath 10 minutes, Try to solve the second problem or the third problem. And if you could solve the first problem and the second problem at least 30 minutes, then you should probably, you should still try to solve the third problem, problem C, because that's what really matters. Um, yeah, so like here in my recent contest, like I solved the first one in 17 minutes, which doesn't really, which is okay in my opinion. Like if you try to solve it in five minutes, I don't, I don't see the reason that, that typing speed would increase. But the second problem, I solved it in 49 minutes and that actually does help you. That boosted my rating way significantly being able to solve the second problem 
from here here to here 830 to like nine like plus plus 156 from being able to solve the second problem instead of just focusing on speed being able to solve the first problem so yeah just focus on solving the next problem in competitive programming and then i think speed would follow after with that um there's really no reason to just try to m minimize the how the time you spend on the first problem like the, solving easy problems that's not going to help you but yeah that's just what my opinion is hope you guys enjoyed this video rate comment subscribe i'll check you guys later peace